Hey guys and welcome to a new video. In this video we're gonna take a quick look at the new patch notes. The first thing that you see is Raffaella redesign. It's not a rework. What they have done, they have changed her skills. They made it better or at least they think they made it better. I'm not sure if it's better. But why they did it is because of the new meta heroes. Raffaella was not really an opponent against those heroes. So what they have done with the first skill, enemy units hit by the lightning of retribution experience a 60% reduction in movement speed. And hitting the same enemy units increased damage by 10% stacks up to 5 times. Then her second skill, movement speed of the ally unit healed by holy he healing receiving a 50% increase for 1 second. So that's a 50% increase in movement speed. Then her ultimate, the holy light, hits enemy units faster than before, creating a smoother experience. And then her passive, they have completely changed it. Uh, we decided to change Raffaella's passive ability to an active ability. While giving her an entire new passive ability, upon death, Raffaella becomes a spirit for 4 seconds. As a spirit, Raffaella constantly heals her nearby allies uh, and increase their movement speed. After the effect ends, Raffaella will use Holy Light to deal true damage to all nearby enemies units. So that's really nice for Raffaella, I can't wait to test that out. Then for Freya, she will get a new skin, a Gladiator. The skin will cost 599 diamonds, but with the 30% off it will be around 420 diamonds, 424. And the skin will be released 21 of May, so that will be in 3 days. Then the hero adjustments. For Chang'e they have changed Run Rabbit Run to uh, Let the Moonlight Shine. Uh, it's a, a cast on the ground uh, when people go in, in it. The movement speed will be reduced and when it ends the skill will pull the enemies towards that center point and will do magic damage. And the cooldown has been adjusted from 9 seconds uh, at all levels. Uh, the lucky bunny reduced maximum stacks from 50 to 40 and reduced stack loss upon death from 25 to 15. <coughs> so it's buff and a nerf. And they refined the voice acting for Cheng. And then uh, Uranus, uh, they have raised the basic uh, volume of the shield from 260 plus 90 gear 6 to 280 uh, plus 120 gear 6. So that's a buff. And then his other skill reduced cooldown by 5 seconds at all levels. So that's also buff. And then Gatagacha increased damage from being 1% of total HP to 1.5%. So that's a buff for Gatagacha. Then Mortis, uh, Mor Mortal Koi, uh, reduced the damage bonus of his first attack total speaker damage from uh, 0.9 to 0.7. Increased the damage taken from 40% to 50% while the uh, skill is active. So that's a nerf. And uh, determined uh, increase the base damage from 600, 675, and 750 to 650, 750, and 850. So that's a buff. Then Sun, they have made him a lot stronger. Movement speed of Sun's double uh, uh, dangers, uh, uh, gangers increased by 20% and increased Sun's. HP recovery by 60%. Then an other skill of him increased movement speed by 30% of Sun and his double gangers for 2.5 seconds. And the other skill increased the attributes of Sun double gangers from 60, 80, and 100% of Sun's own attributes to 70, 85, and 100%. Uh, additional double gangers will take less extra damage while charging so that's a really good thing for Sun I hope he will be worth it to play again then uh, change here his name from all red to all dust so that is a change in his name you can see here his 
skills. I don't know if it's a buff or a nerf. I'm gonna go quick over them. If you wanna read it, you can pause the video. Then we got Kagura, a refined yin yang gathering, description, and actual effect for improvements. Um, Johnson, refined uh, electro airbag, description, and actually effects for improvement accuracy. Akai, they have refined Akai's and his skin's battle animations. For Nana, refined the animation of slumber party skin first skill. Then we got the battle adjustments. Mayhem mode is already out in the normal server. Uh, Calamity Rapper fixed an issue where the trigger effect Calamity is impacted by lifesteal effects. Now we got the new events and futures. Then we got the system adjustments. Let's get down the bug fixes. So this where the patch notes I can't really show you guys anything new because the skin is not out yet for Freya. I can show you guys she still got all the skins that we already have. The new skin is not in it yet. And for Raffaella she still looks ugly. But yeah, they have changed her skills. Ah, you can see here better. I will go over it one by one so you can probably read it better and understand it better than it says in the patch notes. Then the holy healing and her ultimate. But yeah, this were the patch notes. Let me know what you guys think and I hope I will see you back at the next one.